this is a first annual event. And so one thing is to give some visibility to Music Youth Partnership so that people know that we exist and why we exist. Music Youth Partnership has sent in two music educators and they have been pulling out uh, individual students that need maybe that extra boost and extra help. The other thing is to raise money to help forward what we're trying to do because if we can find instruments, we buy instruments, uh, people can donate instruments, then we can provide them to kids who may be interested in playing who might not otherwise have them. So it's both fundraising and an opportunity to be more visible in the community. There are three bands from USD 259, the Wilbur Middle School Jazz Band, also the Northwest High School Jazz Band and the East High School Jazz Band. And then the headliner group will be the big band from Friends University. Also tonight as kind of a draw and because he supports us, Phil Stacy is here and his daughter Michaela is also here and each of them are going to be featured singing with one of the bands tonight. I can't imagine what my life would have been like had I not been involved with the music program at Northwest High School. Music Youth Partnership is designed to basically help kids who might otherwise not be able to become musicians by virtue of being able to give them instruments then provide them some guidance towards where they can get the training that they need. Music is a way that I find a way I can express myself and I think it's really nice that they're like doing this for kids our age because it's going to help a lot more kids like in needs get that kind of like help they need and like that coping mechanism they might not have which is what I find in music. It's a creative outlet for me. I just enjoy performing with people who enjoy performing with me and that sense of community it gives me. Music Youth Partnership's goal is to empower students to experience their best academic, social, and musical potential. And they do this in a very interesting way by providing individualized education to students. They actually bring paid veteran teachers into the school departments during the day that will actually meet and mentor and develop relationships with students. It's really been a blessing to have these extra people come in and, and help. I'm seeing confidence in the kids grow. They've also pulled out sections of kids. Um, one of them has pulled out all my clarinet players and is working on those upper register skills that are so important for them to go on. With Music Youth Partnership, I think there are lots of things that are coming down the road that we haven't even thought of yet. But part of it is just giving kids an opportunity to be exposed to the idea that they too can be one who makes music. And if they're drawn to a particular instrument, that's one thing. If they want to explore different kinds of instruments, that's another thing. But if they really want to make music and they don't have a pathway that shows itself easily and quickly, that's what Music Youth Partnership is for, to say, hey, here we are. If you want to make music, come see us. We'll try to find a way to help make you do that. Music is just a really great activity for kids to be involved in, and it's something they can do for a lifetime. If they get good enough, they can get scholarships to college, and then it, it, they, they can just do it forever. I mean, there's adult groups in the community that they can eventually be involved in. This is a, a great benefit to USC 259 because many of the kids who will have an opportunity to be helped by Music Youth Partnership will come from USD 259.